everyone from the Ryland Faults MWR Library in Landstuhl. I'm Miss Claire and I'm going to read Jerry Spinelli's book called My Fourth of July. Noise! I wake up. I rush to the window. Parade, drums, cymbals, pinwheels, flags, tricycles. It's the best day of all. Fourth of July. I join the parade. Grown-ups laugh and wave and point. I'm still in my pajamas. When I get back, Dad is fetching the wagon. Hooray! He is home all day. Mom is in the kitchen getting the picnic ready. The pie is in the oven. What kind? I ask her. You'll see, she says. She always says, you'll see. The pie is always cherry crumb. Time to do my job, I ask. Mom hands me a shaker. Get to work, she says. I get to add the final touch, a sprinkle of paprika on the deviled eggs. Everything goes in the wagon. Hot dogs, hot dog rolls, mustard, chopped onions, relish, pickles. I look at the clock. I call to everybody, hurry. I'm in charge of hurrying. There are only 25 picnic tables at the park. We must not be late. The wagon is filling up. Peanut butter filled celery boats, potato salad, napkins, tablecloth, red, white, and blue cupcakes. In goes the surprise in a white box. There's always a surprise. What is it? I ask. I always ask. You'll see. Mama always says. Paper cups, plastic forks, are we ready? Wait, I shout. Don't forget the pie. I'm in charge of not forgetting. Finally, out the door. Mama hands me a banana. I'm so excited I forgot to eat breakfast. Down the street to the railroad tracks. Look, black cloud, thunder. Oh no, storm coming. Yahoo! It's a train rumbling round the bend. Flags flutter from the flanks of the great engine. We wave to the engineer. Down the path by the creek to the park. Hurry, hurry! I grab the pickle jar and run ahead. I plunk it on an empty table. It's ours! I can't wait. I beg for the surprise. Mama sighs. Okay, go ahead. I tear open the white box. Chocolate covered strawberries, big as plums. Mom and dad watch me. They can't stand it. They gobble up their surprises too. For this one best day, the park is my backyard. Face painting, I'm a raccoon. Three legged sack race. My friend Henry and I come in last. We're laughing too hard to care. Back to the table, food, eat. We cook our hot dogs on the grill in the gazebo. We wait our turn. I like mine with black stripes. Talent show in the band shell. There's my neighbor, Sally. She sings a song called Somewhere Over the Rainbow. I'm amazed. Sally is my next door neighbor. Sally sings like an angel. Concert at the gazebo. The Tootletown 10 plays zippy music. Little kids rush to the stage of the gazebo and dance. Parents, too. Here come mom and dad. Back at the band shell. The biggest flag I have ever seen is unrolling behind the stage. We stand for the Star Spangled Banner. The whole park is silent and still. Back to the picnic table. Eat, eat. Nose ball race. I win. Run to the zoo. Quack at the ducks. The goat makes me laugh. Monkey fingers reaching. More food. I am becoming a pickle, potato, hot dog, cupcake, pie. Slow down, Mama says. But she doesn't mean it. She's smiling. The shadows are getting long. The sun is in the trees. The best part of the day is coming. Fireworks. I eat the last deviled egg. We toss the trash and give away the pickles. 
All that's left is for the wagon and tablecloth. Hurry, I say. I'm in charge of getting a good place. We find one out on the outfield slopes of the baseball field. Soon we're surrounded. I think everybody in town is here. 5,000 people, Dad says. Shadows creep across the field all the way to me. Oh, the minutes crawl as I slide back in my wagon. It's the longest wait there ever is. I thump in the dark, sudden umbrella of lights, 5,000 faces aglow. Fireworks! My eyes cannot hold the wonders I see. My heart is cheering. Pinwheels and gushers, comets and twisters. A cannon booming volley. I hold my ears. I scream with joy. And it's over. Car lights flashing. Smoke drifting from the baseball field. It smells like burnt toast. And once again, I feel something I haven't felt since the last 4th of July. I feel sleepy. The tablecloth becomes a pillow in the wagon. I go my own little train with dad as the engineer through the park, across the street, down the path. I see nothing but stars. There are only stars in my wagon and me. I am overfilled in every way. I have seen too much, run too long, and been too happy. I close my eyes, and I am in charge of sleeping. The end.